how to set up shipping in GoDaddy. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can set up and add shipping profiles into your GoDaddy website. So it is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over godaddy.com select the website and hosting right there as you can see on the header select website builder and here we are now after you have signed up and or signed in into your account you're going to click on the account name it will drop down a menu select from this menu my products under the account setting so right here you're going to see the dashboard of your account once you are here you're going to see the different websites that you own for setting up the shipping profiles or the shipping in general, you need to have a store integrated or installed into your website. So you need to create a website that contain a store. So how we can do that, you're going to click on set up a free website here. And from there, you're going to select the element, which is going to be here in the first case, sell something right there or sell with an online store. Once you have selected that, you're going to generate or uh, here apply the store page or the shop page into your website. So from these, I have a lot of pages or websites that contain a store already. So I'm going to choose one of them and how we can go ahead and see that if our website contains a store installed or not on the website dashboard. You're going to see here at the left side of the screen, we have the menu items, we have store. Usually or generally, if a website doesn't contain a store, it will not show up right there. So we are going to click on store. We are going to see the different elements from store, but we are going to click on settings. Now we are going to wait for the settings to pop up here. We have the general settings about the business info, the uh, let's say here the time zone, the country, the switch address, and etc. We have the shipping, the payment methods, the tax collection, the checkout parameters, and the abundant card automations or some regulations. So we are going to select here shipping, and from here you can see the delivery methods. You can go ahead and add a delivery method, but here the basics are given already so we have a free shipping which is going to be including australia and here uh, only australia we have a local delivery you can go ahead and add it or in person pickup you can also add it for the delivery method i'm going to click on add and we can add an international right there a delivery we have free shipping flat rate or percentage per order or weight based so I'm going to select here flat rate. This is the most of the cases. Click on add and you are going to set up here uh, the title or the standard shipping three to five days, the fixed amount, for example, or a percentage for the uh, standard, for example, shipping. This is the name of it. For the charge per order, we are going to charge $25 per order. So the uh, ship to these countries or regions, you're going to set it here, all countries and regions, or you can go ahead and add or all the countries. Click on save. And here we have added a shipping profile or a shipping method. So that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.